Hello, hello, hello. How are you all today? Fab to have you here. Today, I'm going to do a video that is appropriate for the slightly nosier individuals out there or any bag lovers who are just curious what other bag lovers happy to, happen to carry with them on a daily basis. I'm going to do a what's in my bag. Now, before I get into it, I do carry a lot of rubbish, so please don't judge me. I carry big bags for a reason. If you have seen any of my previous videos, you will see I have an affinity for larger bags and I have quite a few large bags in my overall collection. I will probably do a full collection at some point, but even my long shop collection will show that to you. So, if you haven't seen me before, hello, my name is Nick. Thank you so much for joining me. If you have seen me before, thank you for coming back. Please do consider giving my videos a thumbs up if you like them and also a subscribe. And let's talk about the elephant in the room. No, this isn't my natural hair colour. Anyway, let's get into it. Okay, so to be able to show you this, I'm going to take a little bit of a seat back just so that you can see. The bag that I'm actually carrying at the moment is this, and this is my Kurt Geiger Double XL flap. I did do a review of these a couple of weeks ago. I will link that in there for you. But I'm going to show you what I carry. But what I do tend to do is move a lot of the products from one place to the other. I just happen to find it very, very easy. So without further ado, let's get into my bag. Okay, it's a big old bag. So, where are we going to start? Let's start in the back pocket. So, I carry a nail file. I carry a long Aspinall wallet, um, which also houses my card holder. I carry... <laughs> So I actually keep the dust bag with it and I'm not 100% sure why, but I just I just keep the dust bag with it. I find it easier um, and I don't tend to use the back pocket. Then I also carry a handbag raincoat. Now, I know that you can buy these from the very high-end designers, your Chanel's and all of those types. I don't have a fancy designer one but it has a little hole in the top there and it's suitable for a range of bag sizes. So that's what I carry as well. So that's to keep my bag dry. And then I carry an umbrella to keep myself dry. Mine is actually from Osprey London. Um, I'm not gonna open it because I'm superstitious like that, but it's fine. And then I also carry one of these and I don't know if anybody else carries these in their bag, but it's to sit on a table so if you have your bag, it's so that you don't have to touch the floor. And the reason that I do that is I'm a little bit superstitious. And it's, the rumor is that if you place your bag on the floor, then your money goes through the floor as well. So I tend to try and hang my bag, if I can, off the back of a chair or using one of these hooks. And I have a couple of those for different bags. I don't like to put a bag on the table or on the seat next to me unless it's vacant. I find that to be a little bit obnoxious, but if if I need to, I will because I don't want my money going through the floor. I need to keep hold of as much of it as I can. Okay, so that is the back pocket. We are now cleared out there. Right, let's go. <sighs> Very important in current times. We have the old face mask. Mine is in this snake. Is that like a fake snake skin print? It's not even close. It's washed out. I keep a pencil case of some description. So mine is in this very, very classy leopard print. <laughs> um, and this is from Osprey. Osprey London. Um, I keep antibacterial wipes. A watch. Because who doesn't just keep random jewelry in the bag? Where's this from? This is from Diesel. This is a watch from Diesel. I like that watch a lot, actually. I bought that in, T I bought that in TK Maxx and it was 50% off. Um, bargain. A second face mask. And this is, oh, God, sorry, my hair. This is actually my favorite face mask. It is from Lacoste. Um, I love these. I want to buy some more of these. Um, I think they're great. I'm going to try and get my hands on some other ones. Um, yes, big fan of that one. Um, I keep my keys. I keep a charger, but without the plug. So that's not really all that useful because that doesn't even plug into my car. Um, 
I keep a glasses case and this happens to have my, so these have my Lacoste cat eye sunglasses in them, which I absolutely love. I just think these are the chicest sunglasses ever. Love those. There you go. Um, and then finally, we have my cosmetics case. And my cosmetics case is from Osprey London. It's in this nice purple colour. And I'm going to give you a glimpse into what I carry in my cosmetics case as well, because I know... Hi everyone, me again. I, of course, also in the current times, also carry a hand sanitizer. This was just in my coat pocket um, whilst I was using it today. Mine is by Carex. It is the Love Hearts edition. It's the fun edition. Um, and it contains 70% alcohol. It's a hand cleansing gel and it's quick dry. So there we go. Right, where were we? So I carry a Mercedes-Benz miniature. This is Mercedes-Benz Eau de Toilette for men. I carry, for some reason, oh, is that a moisturizer? No, it's a shower gel. Apparently you need that on the go. That was clearly a, didn't have a home for it, so I've thrown it in here, maneuver. I don't clear this out like I should, in all honesty. Um, another nail file, pretty sure I've already spoken about a nail file. Um, I carry plasters or band-aids, dependent on where you are in the world and what you choose to call them. I've got two, just in case. I carry my Jupe Go Eau de Toilette. Is this Eau de Toilette? No, it's a spray, that's different, isn't it? Eau de Parfum. Eau de Toilette, no, it is Eau de Toilette. Okay, I don't really know. Anyway, um, I digress. So this is actually my favorite fragrance of all time. Lacoste Red is another Armani Diamonds um, and also the Dolce & Gabbana 6, is it number six? They don't do the number range anymore, which was really disappointing. I used to then buy it on Amazon when it was discontinued. And you now can't get hold of it, which is a shame because it smelled beautiful, but it's probably done my bank account a favor because I think you were looking at about hundred pounds for a decent sized bottle of it. It was a lot of money. Um, I buy, I wear fragrances a lot. So I tend to buy quite large sizes. Normally hundred milliliters is the smallest size I'll buy. Anyway, you don't care about that. Okay, what else do we have? We have some medication I keep on with me. Uh, we have Vaseline because dry lips are not the one. Few things worse than when your lips get really dry and they start to crack. You know, obviously there are a lot of other worse things, but I do find that dry lips can be really painful. So try to avoid that wherever I can. I carry a also a Ted Baker miniature. What is now going on with my hair? God. Ah. This is all very chaotic, isn't it? Um, so a Ted Baker miniature, that is Ted Baker XO. Hmm. Smells good. I tend to just throw miniatures in and just use them on the go. Um, I carry a toothbrush. My toothbrush is from Colgate. I do use an electric toothbrush normally, but this is obviously just my on the go. Although I don't have toothpaste, so that's probably a little bit of a boo-boo in itself. I have the little ring from an electric toothbrush that you put around the edge of it. And then I also have hair grips because that's how all of this tends to stay in check when I'm doing whatever. Oh, I actually have lots of hair grips. That's where they all go. I lose those. I don't know if anybody else loses those, like nobody's business. I personally do. Okay, so that is what I carry in my bag on the whole. Um, I do often have other random things, like I might have some gum in there or a bottle of water or something like that. I haven't had any of that stuff in recently because I've not really been going out for a long period of time. If I am, that's probably what I've taken to the shop. Um, but if I'm going out, you know, for a whole day, I would probably carry some other stuff, you know, some sweets, some gum, some water. I normally carry a little bottle of Diet Coke with me as well. Um, but anyway, hope you've enjoyed seeing what's in my bag and let me know what your thoughts are or if there's anything that I'm missing that you're thinking that is an absolute must have. You need to have that in your bag on a daily basis. Let me know. Anyway, thank you for watching and I will speak to you soon. Mwah.